How long does it take you to stop if you're driving fast? Do you know? Well, there is a class of physics 11 students in Greater Victoria that has the answer to the centimeter, but they had to smash into a pink bunny first. Bruce Kirkpatrick explains. <laughs> If you're wondering why a police car is racing around a Squamalt High, it has to do with a teacher and a bunny. <laughs> I want you to live bunny of physics, but you might not. <laughs> Dana Bjornsson brings a long-haired student to class, here to find out how long it takes to stop in increasing speed tests. We're taking a little bit of Galileo, a little bit of Newton. They measured things like distance and coefficient of friction and decided where bunny could sit safely, with someone heading toward him at 60k allowing 12 meters to stop. So I figured once one of my strides is about a meter, so I just took about 12 strides and we, that's where we put the bunny. Constable Ross Smith, 65 kilometers an hour, can he stop in time? <laughs> just scrapes and bruises, you barely grazed him. Well, that's good, then uh, next Easter we're still good for some candy, I'm thinking, what do you think? Waiting her turn is Shelby. She's been driving for two months now. Can you stop in time? Yep, <laughs> hopefully. You travel this far at 60 kilometers an hour in one second. 65K, 70 kph. Bunny is toast. Have you attended accidents where five kilometers an hour would have saved a life? Yes, uh, especially with ABS now, we have, we can, uh, uh, if you have it under five kilometers per hour difference, you can actually steer out of that. Increasing your speed a bit means stopping distance increases a lot. It's not a one-to-one -one relationship. So if you increase your speed by this much, your stopping distance isn't going to increase by this much. It's going to increase by that much. Time for Shelby to give it a go. Shelby did fine, but worries about others, particularly... Speeding and not looking where they're going. And if it had been wet out here, you would have taken Bunny's life. Yep, <laughs> definitely. And Bunny? CPR on the track. And in the end, this furry student got to debrief with other physicists learning to drive safely. 